here's something I was fascinated by. I read somewhere uh, you wanted to stab uh, Tahani in season one. You said that the character yeah, in the not, beginning not a fatal stab, just sort of a light wound. Send a message. Yeah. Yeah. Just to get her to stop being such a um, asshole. <laughs> She was intolerable for a lot of season one, which is kind of more fun to play. And also I based her off someone intolerable that I knew in England who I will not name. Uh, never, ask, never ask you to name names. But they have been blocked on my Facebook, so I don't know if they found out or not that it's them. But it's fairly like I've fully ripped off their character no. and their personality yeah, to play this. So that was quite fun to like exercise those demons of everything you find annoying about someone to be able to play that out and make money from it. Uh, yeah. yeah, it's been uh, that's, great. That's the secret, isn't it? Figuring yeah. that part out. Well, but, that's but why then I was... you learn about her backstory and you develop empathy for her. And I, and I, I did. And I've actually kind of developed empathy for, for more annoying people since. <laughs> You know, because I realise that there's there's no such thing as bad people. There's just sad people. Actually, no. In the news, we've realised there are some very bad people. Quite a few. Yeah, but, there's a couple of know, bad people. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that we can't. But Tahani is not one of them. She's just really desperately insecure, and actually so similar to so many people that I meet in this industry that it's scary. So. Well, that's and, and and that's what's why people I think latch onto this show is, is yes, it's high concept, but these characters, there's so much that we can identify, and we're insecure, all these different things, and we mm. see these different things, and that's where it comes from, and we fall in love with everybody, and I just I loved the idea of in the beginning you wanted to stab her, you've gone on this journey together, and now you've kind of embraced her, no more stabbing. Mm -hmm. uh, but what's funny to me <laughs> is uh, actors often come in here and they tell us about what drew them to the role, how they fell in love with the character right away, and and then you seem to have a different uh, perspective on that. You, you didn't fall in love with the character right away, but you were in love with the project. What, what was it about you that said, I must do this? Well, not just that, but also I didn't know who the character I was going to play. We had to yeah. sign a seven-year deal before knowing what the show was about or who we were playing or what the storyline was or who else was going to be in it. So you have to sign your life away, and the whole thing was kept under wraps. There was no script. There were fake sides, fake names. So I was like, what if this is Mike Scher's first porno? <laughs> Level, what if baby? this is a late night, terrifying pornography film or series that I've now uh, like embarked upon and I'm signed a seven year deal. They'll sue me if I don't get my bum out. Like, I didn't know. Uh, but so I was very relieved to find out everyone was fully clothed. And uh, actually, Tahani got no action. But um, indeed, it, was a, it, was a, it wasn't a, a role I was ungrateful to play. It's really fun, but I just couldn't resonate with her at all. And I, the writers are so brilliant, and they make all of us so like so relatable. To every everyone, I think finds something of themselves in each of the characters. Yeah. And I've fallen in love with all the characters. I'm such a fan of the show, and because we do a lot more, increasingly more and more separately from each other, I get to watch it and see scenes that I'm not in, and I never got to see how they played out. And really, just I'm such a mega fan nerd of the show. I. Instagram and tweet about it more, like more than the entire rest of the cast combined. Uh, my Instagram is basically a fan account for Ted Danson, <laughs> you know, and so I am a proper good place nerd.